But remember this, I've already said it to you. They are superstars. So as they come on stage, you guys, I gotta cheer and clap for them. Because if you don't, this could happen. And it did happen twice last year. As soon as he got to that door, no one clapped. She turned around and went back downstairs. <laughs> She's now been doing this for two seasons. She knows what should happen. But believe this, each sheep coming on stage have got their own personal music. They love their music, my sheep. So listen to the music. It suits the breed of sheep. No further ado, I'm going to introduce you to the first guy coming on stage. So please, put your hands together and welcome Nobby the Norfolk Hall. Need a hero to respond out of he was. Breed a sheep was bred over 400 years ago. He was bred back then for his wool, but back then wool was like gold. His wool built most of the churches and the older buildings around Norfolk. But he's not a very good wool breed. He's not a good meat breed. Nowadays he's absolutely good for nothing. <laughs> Sadly, that's why they're just about extinct. There's only 800 left of this breed. You can see why they're going to come extinct. There's other breeds of sheep coming on stage. They do a much better job. sheep I've ever had to deal with. He comes from Scotland. So please introduce you to Dougal, the Scottish Blackface. Come up, Dougal. <laughs> now this is one of the toughest and hardest had to deal with, but he comes from Scotland, up in those highlands where it snows, it blows, it rains. Firstly, they needed an animal to survive there, and most of these breeds would not survive where he can. The kind of night to eat, a meat, meat, because of her mum though, she is a good wool breed, can produce two to three kilograms of wool, can produce two good lambs. From her dad though, what the hardness, she walked her babies. The wife's number one breed in the UK, it's from dad. Reminds me a little bit of Bob Marley, you'll see what I mean. Please welcome on stage, Lenny, the Lincoln Longwall. Come out Lenny. It'll be all right, man. Yeah, it'll be all right. This guy reminds me a little bit of Bob Marley. Is this breed? They love grass. A little funnier than that. Now this breed of sheep has so only a handful of breed of sheep has. They have the double muscle on their bottom. Which means on that smaller frame of his, he can actually produce more meat than any other breed of sheep can. Now Sam doesn't like him, he is number one in the world. But he is not the number one terminal sire in the sheep and my poops. I'm going to use this thing here which we call a handpiece. Now you might think that this could really look like it could really hurt a sheep. But if you want me to, I'll demonstrate on myself first and show you that it won't hurt it. Would you like me to show you that? Really? Guys, it's just me. 